Grenoble de Management welcome Dr. Greg Glover from the Harvard University to co-teach a class with Mark Thomas, Professor of Strategic Management. Most of Dr. Glover's experience at Harvard has been with the School of Education. I wanted Greg to come here and teach because uh, I know he's a great teacher. He's had 25 years of experience uh, working at Harvard. And there's also a lot of talk in business schools, in universities, that there's a tendency of um, disciplines just to talk to each other. The material we were covering, uh, thinking about leadership and organizations, um, it really transcends business and education. Some of these themes are common to both fields. I think having two professors from different backgrounds were really interesting. Uh, uh, Guy Glover from Harvard, it was really, it went really to educate us, to show us really uh, technical examples. And the background from the business school was more um, examples from companies, from the business, so we could see how it was applied in the real life, so it was really interesting. Opinions taken after the class were very positive. What was Dr. Glover's impression of teaching business students? You know, I find that um, professional students, professional graduate students, uh, are just that much more serious. You know, they're, they're, they're here for a purpose. Uh, they're taking their roles seriously and their studies seriously. And I certainly found that to be the case in, in how engaged they were with, with, uh, with our lesson. Um, and, but at the same time, I found that uh, their particular orientation to the, to the lesson was just a little bit different, which I really admired and respected. Um, I learned a great deal as a result too, which was uh, terrific. Having two professors from different disciplines in the same class is quite original. What did the students get out of this approach? We uh, learned a big difference between, um, between the management and the leadership. And also, uh, we learned about uh, four different frames, uh, four different frames to uh, to analyze a, a company, and we also uh, made a, a little um, a test to uh, to figure out which was our uh, leadership styles. We automatically felt that uh, we were in the subject because we can use ourselves as an example, mm -hmm. and that changes a lot. It's not just theory. It's practice in a way because we are in it completely. Greg was very much more in a conceptual uh, framework and I was much more in a practical examples based framework. The ultimate goal for all students is to be competent and effective when they start working. How do lessons like this enable them to think about the ways they can make a useful contribution to an organization as a manager and as a leader? I think it will help me when I start in company to uh, know that there are different frameworks so that not everybody is like me, so maybe I will be more open-minded to others. Uh, it will help me because I will um, uh, think about myself and uh, change myself in the way that I will be able to uh, know where my weaknesses are and where I can, I'm strong enough so I can um, improve my skills as a leader because, of, well, as a future manager, I hope, I, w I wish I will be a leader too. I found the, the students to be really engaging. Um, they seemed really uh, to be interested in the material and thoughtful. Uh, I found their questions to be uh, insightful. And I think uh, companies will be very smart to look hard at graduates here in terms of hiring and for, for, for future. At least that's been my impression. So. This class was the chance to give students a different perspective on management and leadership.